Last night, Scott Morrison handed down the government's 2017 budget. And whilst there were a number of leaks during the week, uh, a number of changes uh, have occurred. So there's an opportunity for first home buyers to save for a home deposit through superannuation. If you're looking to purchase your first home, the new proposals may be advantageous. There's also a great opportunity for those over the age of 65 to make a non-concessional contribution into super um, if they're um, considering downsizing their house. So this is up to $300,000 each and it won't uh, count towards any contribution limits at present. Uh, it will, there are some details and you can't do it until July 2018. So if you are looking at doing this, make sure you talk to us to, uh, to see if this strategy could be right for you. Fortunately, there were no other significant changes to SOPA, uh, which is great because we're still implementing a lot of last year's budget changes. A couple of other things uh, in last night's budget, uh, the, there was the reinstatement of the pensioner concessional card that was uh, lost earlier this year. Uh, there will be an increased Medicare levy from July 2019 and there's a number of rental property changes. Uh, so please have a read of the attached uh, document to see how this is actually going to affect you if it does. Um, we do suggest that you consider making extra super contributions uh, into your super funds uh, if it's applicable pre-30th of June this year. Um, please reach out to, to chat to Warren, myself uh, or Glenn uh, and see how you can actually enhance your wealth accumulation plans uh, by making the most of the, the super changes that came in last year. And as always, uh, the devil's in the detail. Um, we won't know uh, until it's actually all legislated and gone through Parliament. Having said that, um, uh, both parties um, have uh, come out and see, we see that there shouldn't be any great opposition uh, to any of the changes, uh, so we should see a lot of uh, the proposed changes actually being implemented this year. Um, you will also have noticed uh, potentially that the markets have reacted to uh, the levy on the big banks. So it's a watch this space to see um, how that level will affect uh, investors uh, with the share price and also dividends down the track. Um, if you've got any questions, you want to review your portfolios or just have a chat about a new strategy that you're looking at, please give us a call. Uh, remember, devil's in the detail and none of this has been legislated, uh, so we do need to uh, wait and see, um, but we'll be in touch if we think uh, that it's going to benefit uh, or uh, impact your portfolios.